Hey guys, happy East Saturday. Uh, yes, I am back with another video and kind of bit of a review for July. Which, yes, I'm filming this at 12 in the morning. And yes, check this out. Now, I didn't show this like three weeks ago because I was going right till like July 1st to come. Which, yes, today is July 1st. So here it is. I know, it's pretty cool, right? It's a basic Carlito Mattel action figure. I think this is like his final WWE figure before he was released from WWE. But good thing he signed with them like just last night or yesterday evening. Um, yep, uh, this is actually him with the pants before he went back to the. Come on, if my camera will focus. Come on. Come on. Hold on. Okay, still not wanting to focus. But, uh, I'm gonna keep it up close. This is actually his face. If... It will show... Oh, wait, no. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, this is like the painted on face before they had to use a little, like special effect effects on the newer figures now but yes it does it's had that little weird peg articulation but again this is actually him with the pants on because you can see carlito pretty cool designs and yep uh i don't know what the name of the title of this video but i'm gonna probably name it name it happy saturday uh And basic Carlito, Dre Mattel, basic Carlito action figure. But um, anyway, guys, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe, and have a great weekend. But still, like, comment, subscribe. Okay, guys, so I actually did get my package from Amazon. So what did I bought? I bought the... Series 137 Seth Frick, well, mostly Seth Rollins. Uh, this is actually his Michael Jackson attire. Like, some people say this is like the one that he wore on SmackDown a few years back. I really still don't remember when he was a SmackDown superstar, you know. But, uh, I'm going to unbox this in the next video, so stay tuned for that. And, I remember told remember I told you guys that I'm getting another Friday Night Surprise plush, which this is the one we're unboxing right now. I still don't get why they put it in bubble wrap. Like, but it is what it is. But, yep. Uh, also, some of y'all want to know, like, why it says character is here. Like, for example, Glamrock Freddy is here. It's kind of like a, a reference, like my own version of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. But uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get Glamrock Freddy out of the bag. Okay, for the record, I had to get a drink. Like taking a little drink break. Okay, like, not like what y'all are thinking, but, anyway, here's Glamrock Freddy. Wow. Every single time I look at this, you guys, like, look at Glamrock Freddy like this, he looks, he reminds me of Jeff Hardy from AEW. There's the security tab. Which, we're going to take that off in a second. Come on, you stupid tag. There you go. Darn it. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so here he is. Out of the bag without the tag on. 
Yeah, um, the last time I did a Five Nights at Freddy's plush unboxing, I want to say it was like about three months ago. Yeah, about three months ago. But anyway, guys, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.